tired. Super full day. I'm riding behind. There's gonna be probably so much traffic and I'm not trying to manifest it, but I was supposed to leave 20 minutes ago. So I got these control acne pads yesterday. Um, they're by Zio from my dermatologist. Here is my face post facial by the way. It is not usually looking like this. It's just red. It's fine. Um, but this is part of my 75 check-in is where we have to take progress pictures every single day. And I use the same bikini. I use two blue bikinis. I use the same thing every single day. I want to see what the swimsuit looks like over time on my body when it changes or if it doesn't change. But my main focus for the 75 hard challenge this time is really, I really want to build muscle. I lost a lot of weight after my ruptured implant. I wasn't working out because I was sick a lot and I just didn't really have a lot of energy. And so now the 75 hard is also for me to focus on gaining that muscle back. All right, so let's get ready for art class now. So part of my 75 hard challenge is no shopping. So I bought these little cuties. My little motivation, my little 75 hard pre-gift to myself. You know, it just popped in my head. It's like, you know when your people are pregnant, they do like baby moons or like a pregnancy gift. Well, this is my 75 hard gift to myself. So yeah, I added no shopping. I mean, obviously I need to buy groceries. Obviously I need to buy like toothpaste and stuff, but it's just how my mind works. I want to get better at not shopping, so I add it to this challenge. And part of this challenge is if you don't do it one day, you can't like keep going. You have to start all the way over. So if I don't finish 10 pages, if I don't finish 10 pages, and I get to nine, I have to start all the way over even if I was on day like 73. So the accountability thing is really good. All right. I am so late. But when I say I'm late, I don't want to sit in traffic. I feel so unorganized because I don't normally do a vlog. It's my first time, so I have eight minutes to get out of the house.
lifting tonight or today going to the gym this morning and after every workout I have my protein shake this protein shake is just all the nutrients and then sometimes I'll have a second protein shake but that'll have nothing in it I'll share it with you guys my protein shake another time when I'm not rush but I have all the things in the morning like I probably don't eat till 10 o'clock in the morning because I'm focused on nutrients I'm focused on drinking my water I'll bring some electrolytes for later. These ones are by Symbotica. They have lemon, citrus, lychee, and watermelon. I'm going to try the lemon citrus. The lychee's all right. It's it's soft. It's not like overpowering, but I feel like I'm totally out of order. It's okay. My skin better it's like the best I use it as foundation all right so I have my art stuff I put on my deodorant after my clothes because I don't like deodorant all down the sides of me I'm weird but that's okay um wallet driving Headsets, talking to clients, the best lip oil in the world, uh, it's the Dior lip oil, 10 out of 10. Alright, let's take Olivia outside because I'm gone most of the day and she, she needs to go outside. Olivia, come on. Sunny day. You all done? All right, now we feed her. What? What? Sit. Sit. Good girl. All right, so one of these. You have to take with no food. I just started taking these. The glutathione, take on an empty stomach. So I take that with the prebiotic, probiotic. One. Three capsules. Actually take some turmeric. On an empty stomach. This one is citrus berry. It's very gel like. Not bad. I'm just like so weird with, <coughs> with taking supplements and stuff like this. Last thing is snacks for the day. Snacks help me not binge eat or overeat, or since I'm on this challenge, fail the challenge. I do grab I do grab snacks that are protein dense. I do grab snacks that won't make me hungry later, so I don't reach for candy. I don't reach for fruit. I actually don't even eat protein bars really. Um, okay, let's go sit in traffic. All right, Olivia, I'll see you later. Bye, Bubby. So not bad. 56 minutes, kind of what I predicted.
wait for the garage to close. All right, so we are driving to downtown Chicago. I like getting out of the house. This is fun for me. I don't have a lot of friends here, but going out, going to the gym is good for me. And then I'll go to art class. So Friday is kind of like my self-care day. Don't really do a lot of work on Fridays. I do a lot of work on myself on Fridays. So it's the feel good Friday. And today is art in the gym. This is my street. The neighborhood is so pretty here in Chicago. All right, we made it. 47 minutes and not bad. So we are doing legs today. And I am excited. It's my second day doing legs. I haven't lifted, like I said, in six weeks. So it's exciting to get back into it. Um, that being said, I am still focusing on my water. I have to hit a gallon of water a day on this challenge for the next 75 days. Really just focus on water in the morning. Um, I haven't eaten anything today. I had my creat or my glutathione, so I will actually take my charcoal and my creatine in the gym. I won't film. I like respecting people's privacy. And then I'll see you guys after the gym. Okay, so we did the gym. So, we've got tunes going, protein shake, and now I'm driving to my art class. Last week was my first week, and I'm excited to keep learning, keep evolving. Life is good today. Growing up in San Diego, I didn't have many um, seasons. There's not snow, there's not a lot of weather in San Diego, except for like the fog. May gray and June gloom, which is like just packed in, but it's nothing extreme like Chicago or heat like Arizona. So I actually really love the seasons. I really love the change. I really love the feeling of a fresh start or something coming to an end. Like it creates like this fire under our butts. Client texts. So I don't know if you guys know this, but I do coach um, on mindset. I'm a life coach. I'm certified, and I coach on mindset, communication, intentionality, purpose, all the things. We all go through things in life, right? So we always have something to talk about. There's always something to work on. <laughs> and I just had a client text me that they wanted a session this morning, but I have art class. I get to go to art class for me. I already ate my chomps, that um, protein snack. I realized I could not do legs without something in my stomach. I get like, I feel my stomach like crampy a little bit. Finish it all, no protein left behind. So now I'm just going to enjoy this little guy. This will be my meal till I get home at 3 o'clock today. So I'm going to go to art class. I am not going to film because I know people don't like to be filmed. So we are home. I have all my art stuff. So this was today's project. We will be painting all this weekend to get better. I'm going to have breakfast right now. It's 2 o'clock.
if you if you've listened to the podcast on uh, episode 25 with Dr. Hansen, we talk about finishing things upon completion. And so I usually just drop my bag and go on to the next thing. But I think part of completion means like putting things away from the day. And so that's what I'm doing here is I'm trying to put things away instead of letting things stack up. Like I see a shoe box, I see shoes over there. Like I'm trying to get better at cleaning as I go. All right, we are unpacked. And now I'm just gonna put everything away. I just walk like this. Build those arm muscles. Biceps are in. These are just five pounds though. Livia! All right, we got a vest. We got a nice warm vest. It's spring, so it's not too hot, but it's not too cold. All right, we're gonna go walk. See you guys after. So I got a few things from Joa Brown. I just wanted some cute camis to work out in. Again, I am not shopping for the next 75 days. So I got my purchases in. <laughs> It counts. Oh, this is so cute. Ooh. Okay. Part of the reason why I'm not shopping is because I want to see how much time I spend on the apps. It's not that I shop a lot. It's like what I do is I'll go look on the apps and just see what's out there. Just so I'm not missing anything. Ooh, this is cute. Um, and so I think it's a complete waste of time. Yeah, I'm calling myself out, but... I know I can be better with my time. So oh, this is a pretty color. Wait, look at this color. All right, let's change. I just got deodorant all over this, but look how cute this is. Whoa! Maybe the other view is better. All right, so this is the first one. Again, this is Joa Brown. I just wanted like, Cute new tank tops, I got my boobies done, so I just want to show off the girls a little bit better. I was so insecure with my last set. Um, my nipples were weird, they were so hard. I had a ruptured implant. I went with more of a natural look. Um, I haven't really talked about my new boob job since I got them done, so the girls are girling but I just wanted a more natural look. And so I didn't want a high profile where there are like balls on my chest, but just like this. So this one is very thick, very like supportive. I love the heart shape. Do we love this one? See? It's this really pretty green. Stashed waist little jean jacket, but it's super thick. And the girls look good. So cute, so cute, so, 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 so cute. All right, so we are going to the sauna. I have my sauna bag packed. I bring my book, a swimsuit, and then I just a change of sweats because I am so sweaty after. Um, I think I have my keys. Oh, and I bring my AirPods because I meditate in the, the sauna. So part of 75 Hard I've added to is meditation and reading, or not reading, but meditation and journaling. So... Last task of the day, and then we get to relax, and I'm actually probably going to paint. 
I love doing the sauna. It's like my favorite thing ever. It just feels so good. I put on the red light and the blue light for my acne. Everything is around acne. <laughs> oh, this is my life. You know, I did do the Avaclar laser treatments and I love them. They've changed my skin so much, but I get an occasional cyst like you guys get to see me on a on a day, right? It happens. I actually really don't wear makeup on those days. I just rock it. I don't really fight it. I just feel like it takes more energy to cover up than to just accept and let it be. Electrolytes. Activated charcoal.
night.